What is good, everybody? It's your boy, Sean Stay Fitted. You already know what it is. We got another drop, like I was telling y'all. I had another one coming in from my guy over at For Sure Kicks. And, uh, man, he delivered. And, uh, boy, can I say he delivered? Check this out. Oh, yeah, it gets real. Uh, just glad I was here to get this because uh, I know y'all been hearing the horror stories about these getting set outside. And that little mark right there, I have you coming home to nothing if it's sitting outside your house. But I try to make sure I'm here so I can meet my packages because I don't want nothing set outside my porch, my yard, nothing like that. With that being said, you seen the box, man. We're going to get right into it. It's your boy, Sean. Stay fitted. Got another kicks pickup from the plug. Let's get into it, man. Forget all that later. Let's go. Like I said, man, we're going to get right into it. Uh, this one here, uh, just a simple pickup, you know what I mean? Nothing too extravagant, nothing too out the world. But like I said, man, y'all need to check out my guy over at For Sure Kicks. This pickup I got came off of Nike.com. Like I told you, anything off Nike.com, as long as they have your size in stock, you can pretty much get it below retail, guaranteed. I keep telling y'all that if y'all sleeping, man, not even if you're just trying to get your early release or general release, man can take care of all your Nike needs period you know what i'm saying like i keep telling y'all looked out for me straight from nike you know what i'm saying we're gonna get right into it like i said nothing too over the top just a little something you know how that go you scroll around you see something and it's kind of like a i need that type of deal and this was one of those need that type of deals so basically just went ahead shot him that text you know what i'm saying i mean you know i i, I chopped it up with him before on the phone and I'm always texting them, you know what I'm saying? So I had to shoot him that text like, my guy, I need this right here. Boom, bam, shot him the screenshot. Shot me a text back, done, don't trip. And like I said, these literally landed yesterday. Uh, took two days to get here. I mean, that that's how my man worked. Like I said, without hesitation, we're going to get into it. You know, long and the story of it, you know what I'm saying? Not trying to drag it out. So let's get into it right now, man. Let me show you what I got. All right, like I said, with that being said, you've seen the size of the box. It's a little awkward, so we're going to have to take it down from down here, and I'm going to let y'all know what's happening. And I know it's been a big topic of conversation, a little off topic. Uh, they've been, a lot of people have been saying Nike should ship in plain boxes, which I kind of agree. I mean, I know they want to give you that feel like, hey, you bought from Nike.com and whatnot. But I mean, I think it's a little over the top myself. And I think this is one of the discussions that's been going on since the beginning. Like you're throwing just do it tape all around it. The big Nike swooshes on the side of it. I think that's a little dangerous too. And not dangerous like, you know, you might get hurt wise. Dangerous like you might get hurt and not get your package wise. I mean, because they're just sitting them outside of your house. And mine came FedEx, two day ship. Luckily, I just happened to be off of work when my package was scheduled to come, so that was a good thing for me. But I know I've been hearing a lot of horror stories about a lot of people not being there to get their packages. So, you know, it's kind of crazy. I mean, I mean, if they ask my opinion, I would say I'd be one of those people to move for plain box shipping. I mean, even keep the tape, because I mean, they would have to literally be up on your box to see what it actually is, you know what I mean? So, I mean, if they want to just give you that feel, I mean, they could just give you the tape, you know, but take the swoosh off the box, man, because, you know, I've been hearing about a lot of people packages getting picked off, you know what I'm saying? I mean, I'm talking picked off like Deion Sanders picked off, so, but, you know, it's just a thing, though. Okay, uh, really, for what I got, I probably didn't need this size box, but once they stuff all this stuff in there, it's crazy. But uh, let's get right into it. The first pickup that I do have two things in here. So uh, let's get into the first one. Oh, and then like I said, again, without too much coming out, there, there's my name and address right there. But I'm going to cover that. But I'm going to let y'all know, man. You see where that's coming from, right? Got that Nike.com. You see my purchases right there. I mean, hey, can't get no more solid than that, man. You get what you pay for. First pickup, man, uh, these were just nice to me. And they were already discounted. And like I said, they were discounted. I still got a little something off of them. So uh, couldn't pass them up just for the look on them. There's some, uh, 
I wonder if there's a name for them, but uh, I guess just uh, some, some Nike joggers, basically. You know, I'm gonna go ahead and peel them up out of here because I really want to see what they look like because I really want to get my hands on these. Let's peel this out of there. Oh, yeah. Just what I was looking for, too. Got the little swoosh on there, nothing special, you know what I mean? And of course, being off the site, I can be able to get them in my size. But yeah, definitely been looking for a pair of these just to throw these on. You know what I'm saying? When you're trying to just be around the house, not really trying to be dressed, but just trying to throw something on. You know what I mean? And I can say a little disappointed they don't have a back pocket, but at least they have the front pockets. That's what I was looking for. So can't be too disappointed in that. But like I said, material is crazy. Pretty sure you've seen this before. But let's get into the most important part of the package. You know what I'm saying? I like that dope little design on the side too, though. But we're going to get into the most important part of the package, though. You already know. Quit playing. You got your Jordan box right there. Let me get a little close up, man, because I got to do this thing. This thing is crazy. Look at this. It's crazy right now. Don't pay no attention to that. All right. But anyway, we're going to get into it. Got your Jordan logo. You got your... Air Jordan mid one and like I said if I'm not mistaken I think these were pretty much just released size 14 retail 110 and these I wanted because uh they were they were just clean something you know what I mean have to have them oh there you go now the way these are being broadbanded out there is their uh, Air Jordan one mid with the Chicago theme colorway which you can tell the Chicago thing color where they're going to give you with the white, the black, and the red, which is usually you'll catch it traditionally being more of the black with like the uh, the white swoosh. And then, you know what I mean? They still keep the red accents around it. So, which made me want to pretty much pick these up. I like how they changed it up and gave you more of the white with the black swoosh on there. It gave you the black tongue, kind of with the neoprene feel. Got your jump man air on there. Of course, your size 14, you got your cocaine white bottoms. So therefore, that's why I really got drawn towards these. I mean, maybe like, unlike most people, I'm a big fan of white shoes. So I definitely had to have these. I think, honestly too, I think, just wanted to be sure they didn't and they didn't. I think this would have been the kind of deal, I mean, if they wanted to, it should have came with another pair of like, either black or red strings in my opinion. But, I mean, you know, it is what it is. It don't cost much to get you another pair of shoestrings anyway. But, yeah, you got that indented accent with the Air Jordan on the side. Got that Jordan there on the tongue. But, um, yeah, I'm definitely feeling them, man. So, like I said, Jordan 1 mid, Chicago theme. I like it. I'm a fan. Got the accents on the back. You know what I mean? Got the white tip on the front where everything meets up. I mean, so, I mean, definitely, I'm a fan. He's definitely going to get some run. And then for it being a one, and then with the retail of 110, with the little discount, if you're getting them off of Nike.com, if you're hitting the plug, man, hit the plug, man. He's coming through. You know what I mean? So, but with that being said, you can't really beat that. Definitely a nice shoe to have for the collection. Like I said, Chicago one, Chicago theme way, or I call it a Chicago one because usually anything in this colorway, I mean, you pretty much know what it's for, for Jordan with his bull days and his bull era. So, you know what I'm saying? You got the Jordan one, Chicago theme, Chicago one colorway, is which I'm calling it anyway. But um, it's a dope shoe, man. You know what I mean? Retails at 110. But like I said, they've hit my guy up for short kicks. As you see, I'm repping. Quit playing, man. You know what I'm saying? It, all, it is what it is, man. I mean, you got to you gotta stay. I mean, if you're going to spend your money, this is my thing. I'm gonna tell you. If you're going to spend your money, man, Spend it the right way, man. Try to keep a little something in your pocket when you're doing it. I mean, that's that's just me. You know what I'm saying? It, it, it's, it's, been, it's been magical since I've been messing with them. You know what I mean? Uh, if it's on Nike.com in your size, you got that. My man got your early releases. You know what I'm saying? Your general releases, whatever you need. Like I said, I highlight them on the IG. Get at him. He's on Facebook. Just send him an instant message, man. Usually responds right back. And if anything, he's going to hit you back the same day. So, I mean, you know... What do you got to lose out here? You know what I mean? Especially, if, you know what I'm saying? You're getting straight through Nike.com. I mean, you you winning. You know what I mean? Just tell you straight up. Like I said, he got your boy, Sean. Stay fitted, right? Chicago, one thing. 
You got your Nike sweats, you know what I mean? With the European feel. Can't beat it, man. Shout out to the plug for looking out, my guy. Everything you done gave me, man, has been on point. Never had no problem, so definitely shout out to you. I'm going to definitely be hollering at you after this. So with that being said, man, you already seen what the pickup is. You seen what came out of the massive box. A lot of this also, man. I don't know what I'm going to do with that. But anyway, man, with that being said, man, I'm going to get out of here, man. I'm not going to hold y'all up. Got your sweats. Got your theme way, man. Holla at your boy. And like I said, man, hit me down below if you want to holla at me. I'll put you in direct contact with him. You know what I'm saying? It's nothing. So get at me down below. Let me know what you think about the pickups, man. Subscribe to the channel if you ain't already subscribed. Hit me with that thumbs up. Hey, you don't like what I'm doing? Hey, shoot me a thumbs down or stay in the comments and let me know what I'm doing, man. Like I said, I'm doing this for y'all, man. Give you that, that average guy feeling on what's out there and what's getting picked up. You know what I mean? That's why you don't see me picking up too much crazy stuff because everything I pick up is what I'm legit wearing. I'm not just throwing it on the shelves. You know what I mean? Oh, and speaking of that, while I'm putting it out there, man, another Vegas trip coming up. Actually, this Vegas trip uh, is a little is a little family oriented, but uh, one of my family members is entering his car in a car show they're having up there. So definitely stay tuned for that. I'm trying to get y'all all the footage I can of that because uh, if nothing else, man, I'm a big car person, especially when it comes to like El Caminos and things. So definitely stay tuned for that, man. I'm gonna get y'all. That's coming up this coming weekend. So I'll be out there from the 19th to like the 21st. So definitely stay tuned for that, man. But uh, hurry up and get this out of here and I drag this on. Like I said, man, it's your boy Sean Stay Fitted. You see what it is. You see what I does. I'm going to see y'all on the next one, man. I'm gone. Holla.